Hey everybody, hope you're all doing well. I'm here at Detectable 2023 with a first look at the fantastic new Nocta AccuPoint. Let's take a closer look at this bad boy. Okay, so this is just a very quick first look at the brand new Nocta AccuPoint. This is the working prototype. It's going to go into beta testing shortly, so it's not imminently available, but it will be very, very soon. Um, once the beta testers have done their thing, um, this should be out there for the public to buy. There'll be a little bit of a pouch with it. Obviously, you'll get the usual other accessories that go with it. Let's pop that in my pocket. All right, but this is the, uh, the item itself, fetching yellow. Uh, I think we're starting to nickname it the banana, or the Noctanana. Um, you've got, just looking at the physicality of it, you've got a uh, size gauge on the back in inches and centimeters. Let's try and get that in focus. There we go. Uh, the tip is removable and you're going to get a spare tip in there. So if that does wear down, you've got a spare tip to replace it with. Uh, you've got a flashlight on the front there and you've got a lovely LCD, discre LCD display screen and a single button. This is single button operation. Okay, there's the Nocta AccuPoint. Love the design of that. Uh, on the back, obviously this is where the speaker is. Take this off. Um, there's a little bit of a knack on the uh, the prototype, but in there is a USB-C charger. Okay, so it's bang up to date on the charging. There we are. Right, let's have a quick look at this. So, we get it on, turn it on. Hopefully you can see the screen. All right, so I'm in the shade. Hopefully you're able to see the screen now. Um, I'll zoom out a little bit. And we'll see if we can get this in focus. All right, so push the button. For one push turns the uh, pinpointer on. You'll notice it is a color display. Okay, this is a full color display. You've got your sensitivity readout up there. So it looks like we've got nine levels of sensitivity on the left there. I'm actually going to zoom in a little bit, see if you can see the screen a bit better. There we go. And on here, you can see it's in one tone. That's the uh, musical notes and the one. Let's turn itself off. There we go. Battery indicator at the top right. And you've got this bar along the bottom. And basically what you do is you've got options down here, depending on where in here you uh, release the button. So if I hold it down and it's in this se central section and let go, that'll turn the uh, pinpointer off. Turn it back on again. This section at the far end here is settings. So if I do that, hold down until we get to there, release and now we're into settings. Okay, so you've got your sensitivity settings there. You can push once to go into that, and you can, uh, I beg your pardon. Okay, no, keep going past it. Come on, Adam. You can tell I've only had this in my hand for a couple of minutes, can't you? So there's sensitivity settings, hold down the button. And there we have it. There's your sensitivity settings, and you can go all the way to the top of nine. Keep pushing, it starts again. Okay. Give it a second, it'll time out. And go back to your options. We've also got, uh, there's your sound and vibration settings. Uh, discrimination, let's go into that. Okay, so you've got uh, one tone, iron off, two tone, this is brilliant, right? So there's uh, your normal ferrous. I don't know if I've got something iron to, have I got anything iron on me? There you go, that tone there, I'm putting on my belt. That tone there, that is the iron tone, okay? So it'll be a normal tone as you get closer to the object, and then as you get closer, if it's iron, it'll start doing that sound in uh, in two tone. Uh, this is a bit off the cuff, this video, guys, so I uh, hope you'll uh, excuse the briefness of it. Let's get back into the settings. Okay, so where were we? So there's your discrimination, let's go back into that. Okay, so there's two tone, and back to one tone. So one tone, iron off and two tone options. Give that a second to time back out to the main menu. There it is. And then we head over to, there's your Bluetooth settings. And to that. Not gonna lie, not sure what that is. <laughs> could be frequency shift. I know this has a frequency shift, so this could be frequency shift. I'm guessing that's a frequency shift. Let's assume it is until we, unless we find another option. Uh, we have got, yeah, here's your flashlight. So yeah, I think that was probably frequency shift. Let's go back and see if we can see the flashlight. There it is, so long press that, get into the options, push the button once and on goes the light. It's quite bright. So we'll turn that back off again. 
Again, with a bit of practice, this will become second nature. There we go, lights off. Wait for it to go back to the menu, and it takes a few seconds. Uh, then we've got the volume controls, brightness controls, and factory reset. So look at that, that is a color LCD screen, fully one button, op button operation, just single presses and long presses to operate. You've got your full read out there, discrimination, frequency shift, sensitivity change. I mean, come on, that is basically a simplex in a stick. Let me zoom out. Now it's on full sensitivity, give you an idea of the kind of distance. I've got my gold ring on. Okay, so let's go up to it. Right, and pull it away. There we are, that's the kind of sound. And as you get closer, it does this. So there's your beeping. It gets faster, and you get a tone when you're right up against it. Fantastic stuff. I can't wait to get my hands on this. So as I said, this will be going into beta testing. Uh, once it's beta tested and all ready to go and be released on the market, it'll be out. Couldn't give you a time frame at the minute. It depends on how long things that take on the, uh, the testing side of things. I will get the retail version when it's ready. But yeah, that, ladies and gentlemen, is my first look at the brand new Nocta AccuPoint. I can't wait for this to get out there. Awesome. Okay, until next time, guys. Have yourselves a fantastic time, and I'll see you soon. Take care.